Hello all, Realmfire here, welcome to an Empire, another Empire War video. So, start off, the enemy fleet about, it's about to attack with Sai, and first off, let's turn on the things before I do anything. I've got a Syndic at 40%, let's see, what else can I build? Nothing. I'm broke. Almost. Um, what do I have on the ground of Kristai? I have one Phalanx Trooper Legion. Training soldiers. Right. Beginning construction. Oh, that's gonna be fun. So, in my intelligence, I forgot about fortifying Kristai. When I did say that I might do that. So, I've actually been... Where were we heading? I... I'm rambling now. Now, to find out where we were, I had to. I had just hit or the orbit of Ordrazi. We're gonna stick something in Vanguard. Um, Jaeger Miner has a shipyard. Nothing special. Let's look here. There is an army here. Merging them all into one. I'm actually just going to remove the heroes real quick for what I'm about to do because I don't feel like fighting that ground battle. Oh! And now we're at Christi. Alright. No ground to space weaponry. Oh boy! So there is a... Pro... Oh! He's new. That's new. Uh, oh, it's Nance. That's two MC-80s. I don't have a chance. Actually, four MC-80s. MC-30, MC-40, two Endurances, I think they are. Dauntlesses. And one Neutron Star. Oh, right. Oh, boy. Well, here's the space battle. Okay. Enemy forces ahead. So the yeah, support ship support ships uh, all right. Okay, so eh, this Actually if I target him they won't be able to bring him back. So, On Deceptors, do your thing. Bombers. Eyes reporting in. No, they're not bombers. Course set. Orders, sir. Here we get the bombers, psychos. Okay, I'm actually going to try and target that thing. Do I have any psychos up here? Not by the looks of it. So, you guys are going to fall back. Navigating to coordinate. Everyone's going to fall back to the defensive line. We're seeing there now. Reporting in. Moving out. I could try and push the offensive, but that would not be the smart thing to do here. Anyways, that reminds me. Well, the smart comment reminds me. I finished the, uh... Thrawn Alliance's book today. It was good. Oh, that's not gonna give me ships. So these guys are gonna scatter. I appear to be losing a lot of fighter squadrons up there. Um, bombers. Go after that. I'm having my ships change trajectories so that I can deal with that easier. Intercepting. Weapons online. 
for the most part, my fleet had the butt turned to that. Actually, you four. Push it. Actually, don't push it, but, like, move that way. Uh, that's doing nothing to him. Right. He has a lot of shields, doesn't he? Actually, that's just not effective against shields. Attack! Oh! He's targeting a support ship. Only get one fighter squad. So I lost the early advantage of having a fighter screen. So retreat. Ah, his engine's been disabled. Oh dear. I it's because I didn't have a core to the fleet. In my if you ask me. I didn't have a core to the fleet, that made me times weaker. Alright, so these guys are gonna push up to or Trazi. They're just gonna roll out of Christai. Right. Gonna push the in increase the defense there, auto resolve that. Okay, I've just come to the realization that I've only fought one ground battle in this uh series thus far and showed it. And Underway. honestly, Jaeger Miner, Jaeger Miner. All right, you boys, got a lead ship. You go back. <laughs> it's Kane. It's Kane. That noise I made. <laughs> I was wondering when Kane would show his head. Um, I'll begin, I guess. I'll be able to inflict minor casualties here, but without a proper fleet. Oh dear. <laughs> well, here's to hoping that I get an offensive force that I can actually use in good solid defense. I should actually have built up defenses here. So what can you give me? Oh, I have a single. I have two syndics that will be deployed in total. So, how much health does Kane have? A bit. I'm gonna start by picking off one of the smaller guys. I'll be able to deal with him. Thought it out. Yes, so I wanna launch a fighter attack there. The yes, Firecraft are gonna hit him. Reinforcements on route. Let's actually take a look. This probably would be a strategic hero because she removes some of the price. Yeah, she decreases price for ships. What do you do? Nothing. So that was under bonuses. So yeah, bonuses actually. Give show the screen, please. No bonuses. What does Kane give? He probably gives a lot. Actually, not that much. You are... Oh, that's not a big ship. That's an enforcer picket. Huh. Ready. Oh, they're wrong. They're not that strong. The Heavy we stand ready. Acknowledge, sir. Add your back in hall. Already on it, sir. Ty squadron here. Ty is reporting in. Fire. 
So I don't know what exploded over there actually. Awaiting your orders. Moving to those coordinates. Hmm. Orders, sir. Split off and hit the packet ship. Oh, that's a TIE Defender. Oh, Kane, you silly, silly boy. We designed them. I think. Oh wait, those guys are infinite. Attack. They're gonna be down two heroes by the end of this battle. Maybe even three, if I have my way. Taking fire. Cause Kane's keeping back a bit. Commander, they're hitting us. Don't. Awaiting your orders. Building trajectory. He's of no threat anymore. Actually, yeah, no, actually, push and. Oh, they've been annihilated. in the outer limits of the SSC's range, I see. I see. Ah, oh, there goes our first Rokia. Oh no, I only get one more of those. And I get one more chaff. Okay. Um... Think. What can I... Okay, so how many fighters does he get? He gets a bit. Using the Macaray as a sort of... cheap dagger. Along with a number of fighter craft. I'm gonna go in and throw off his fighter superiority. Sorry about that. I just accidentally moved this window. My only hope now is to um, I can't really see how much shield he currently has. Well, it's over. Pushing the dagger as far as I can. So I won't be able to win this with what I have here, but with what I have, hopefully returning from the front. Like, yeah, soon, immediately after this, I'm calling in my support fleet. 
while my forward fleet. Hopefully I catch him still in orbit. Literally, all I've got to do is get in a vigil, and then, boom. This is chaotic. How many shield? So this won't stand up to an ISD to an uh, SSD's attack on its own, but hopefully with what I'm doing, I'll be able to weaken this man enough. What I'm doing is doing next to nothing, so... Doing the best I can, however. Wait! We got his shields down! There's hope! Well, Kane isn't quite so invincible, but... Oh, sorry. We lost, but Kane isn't quite so invincible as believed. Well, as I believed. This is actually a fairly fun and interesting battle. Actually... Makare, now is your time to shine on the Corvette of the Chisholm of the Chiss Ascendancy. Well, actually right now Empire of the Hand, but Ah, uh, he's not gonna escape, is he? He's not gonna survive long enough for this to work, so Either way. Fun battle. And now my transports are going to get caught here. As soon as I leave for the galactic map, I'm going to pause. <sighs> boy, oh boy, oh boy. One thing I want to do, though. Oh, I don't have any in this fleet. Back to Jägerminer. Back to Jägerminer. Back to my... Yes! Alright, we have done what I wanted. There they are. So... Doing what I'm about to do here is going to be a bit risky. Or that Corvette's purpose is simply a distraction. Choose your reinforcements. Orders confirmed. We'll get there. Location locked. Heading out. Orders confirmed. Ascending moving out. Destroyer en route. Coordinates set in. Moving to coordinates. So the Indigo is not going to be a major player in this, however, so the Prolipsy will be. So...
right now, Kane is more worried. Well, it looks like Kane's right now more worried about the Corvette than he is about the actual fleet. So, real quick, I'm going to pause this, and then I'm going to send all my smaller craft at them. Along with doing that. There's no hangar, is there? Interceptor here for the Empire reporting firing. Yes, sir. An actual TIE fighter squadron Boy, is being deployed. Yes, Don't see many of those in chest service, no, do you? Attacking the lasers. All power to the engine. This here is like Thrawn's personal little fleet against Kane. Tie squadron here, changing course to intercept. Here we see the Chiss ascend the not Chiss ascendancy, the Empire of the Hand, proving that it is able to deal with bigger threats. All right. Go after the stragglers. I'm on them. Regroup for another attack. Choose your reinforcements. I'm going to sacrifice another Macare. Macarea, I think actually is how they're pronounced. In my sights. Coming back around for another run. I need more chaff than the fleet. Now that I know Now that I look at that, I need more chaff. What are you doing? Where are you going? I'm on them. Stay in Why are you flying away? What? Oh wow, that's a very long range bombardment. Oh, he's coming over here now. For another attack. They're coming in quick. Go, go, go! Launch, launch, launch! In range. More enemy craft attacking the lasers. Form up. Target locked. Ready for orders. Oh, he's coming over here. He's mad. He's getting his face kicked in, and he is mad about it. Oh, I'm about to have my face kicked in. Uh oh. Everyone just target the ship. Target the ship. Commander, they're hitting us. What do you need, sir? Where'd he go? You three, uh Ooh, I'm gonna begin panicking. So Syndex move up. Syndex move up. Falling out of formation. Eee, he's beginning to f they're in range now. Okay, so that means Syndex you are clear to launch a minor offensive. Same goes for you four. Of course Thrawn approves. Thrawn's here. So, in his, so behind him, I'm beginning to 
my own small offensive. So they're hitting his weak side. Watch for enemy ships. Nowhere to go. I copy. Attack. Just go on the offensive. Don't slow down. Indigo, you have full permission to engage. You guys, so do you. Oh, there's so much in this battle. And then he has the uh, other ship that he can bring in, doesn't he? We had to turn him. He got turned like this on his own. So that that was his own choice, I think. Also, it's F12 for the screenshot. There we go. I think that'll be nice. If I edit that down a bit. Nah, never mind. I'm really only scared of Super Star Destroyers because of their size. It's kind of scary looking at their size and then being able to defeat them with a fleet like this. You guys target their engines just to annoy them. We're pretty much shredding Kane at this point. And this will be like one of the longest videos just because I had to kill Kane in it. But, that being said, actually, stop, 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 stop. Right now, everyone is like focused on killing Kane. It's amazing. All right, HVG next. We lured them into the battle at Yega Minor. Well, less lured. I was more surprised by that. But due to the Battle of Yega Minor, that's what I'll call it. The battle. Of, <laughs> that'll probably be the name of this episode. I was originally gonna call it something like the Hunt for Kane, but we didn't really go hunting. So, yeah, I, I'm like syncing up names for the video as it happens. Yes, Commander. All fighters attack. Uh. Awaiting your command. So I'll call this the battle for Jaeger Minor. Our target priority is the laser cannons. Literally, last episode I stepped into the war with the Pentastar alignment, and this episode, on. I kill their leader. It's amazing. I say step into a war. I started this war. I have them now. Fully conscious that Kane had a super star destroyer, too. Coming around. Eliminating target. Target locked. Excellent shot. I've got them in my sights. But I was kinda hoping that I'd fortify a couple worlds and then he'd go on the offensive, like he'd have to deal with Zinge. That's I I wanted him to deal with Zinge before. He tried to retake his territory. But, I think, I guess that's what happens when I attack too early. But I mean, if I can take this quadrant, the area of the Pentastar alignment, I'll definitely have a, uh, a solid stepping off point for the rest of my conquest. Boom!
Now imagine if this fleet caught him when there was still a uh, actual fleet here. I mean, not an actual fleet here, but when there was still a station here. It would have been a one-way bloodbath. And I would have lost way less. Hope, well, likely lost way less, I mean. It would have gone a lot quicker, though. That's for sure. And there we go. That's this video. As soon as the, uh... As soon as we look at the uh, battle results, I lost four Macarayas and a uh, Kinigos. Construction complete. Tactical battle imminent. Anyways, I'm gonna stop this video right here. I will see you all next time. Have a good one.